We're at Sunnybank Mills in Farsley, where they're holding a weekend of heritage open days, including this mini weaving mill, which is a plywood replica of the 1912 mill, where kiddies of all ages can learn about weaving. Upstairs in the spinning mill, you'll find about 10 different artist studios, normally off limits, but on this open day, you can go in, have a look around, meet the artists and maybe buy something. My name's Zoe Ed. I make okay. stained glass windows. So, okay, I want this. Hello. <laughs> so, um, lino print? So it was a lino block that was about A4 sized and then I printed that onto acetate. What, no chips? <laughs> oh, it has got chips. Oh, it has got chips. Oh, it's got chips. Oh, it's oh. Whitby. Oh. this. Oh. And that's Whitby Abbey up there. Yep. Yep. Steps. In the loft of the spinning mill, painter Mel Davis has got a whole room full of his recent work from about a year ago, and I've got to tell you, it's all fantastic. I love it. After that, we went downstairs to his studio to see if he was in. I'm here in uh, Sunnybank Mills Artist Studio with artist Hi. Mel Davis. Hello. Hi. So, you, you do this full time? No. I'm, I'm retired now, so more or less I'm, I'm down here every day, you know, home from home. Yeah. I think you had a, a really bizarre job before becoming an artist. Oh, well, I was a lawyer for 30 years. A lawyer? It, well, it, yeah, it's sort of in tandem, in tandem with painting. But <laughs> I always felt I was up there under false pretenses, so, you know. Oh, so. Creativity. <laughs> Oh, your work is so happy and joyous. Well, yeah, well, that, that's uh, it. Sort of, you know, that's that's what my work's about. Oh, it's nice where it gives you a lift. Yeah, and, uh, and colour. I love working with colour. Well, thank you very much. Nice to see you again. Yes, thank you.